Okay, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to do a normality test in a distribution, in, in a data distribution to demonstrate uh, statistically if a group of data is normal or not. So we're going to start creating a group of data on column C1. So we click on Calc and then we click on Random Data and then we go to normal. So the uh, th remember this is random data. So how many data do we want? We want 100 random numbers in column in column C1 with a mean of 2.5 and a standard deviation of 0 0.003. Those are random too, obviously. So then we click OK. OK, so now we have our 100 numbers in column C1. OK, so we want to test the normality of the distribution. And then we click on Stat. And then we go to Basic Statistics. And then we click on Normality Test. So which data do we want to test? is the data in column C1. So we double click on data C1 right here where it says variable. We make sure that this is that none is clicked under per percentile lines and then under test of normality we checked Anderson Darling. And then we hit OK. Now we get a probability plot of our data and then the p-value, it says right here that is 0 0.484, which means is uh, greater than 0 0.005, which means that the null hypothesis is accepted, which means the p-value, I mean the probability uh, of the data being normal is um, greater than 95%. So we have a uh, normal data right here, obviously. So now we're going to work with the data that is not normal. So we click on data 2. We type in data 2 right here. And then we are going to create some random data for a non-normal distribution. Uh, let's just say it's going to be a uniform distribution. So we want to store a uniform distribution on column C2. And we're going to do 100 numbers also with a lower end point of 2 and an upper end, end point of 4, which I chose randomly also. And we hit OK. Now we have our 100 numbers. So then we do we go and do the normality test. We go to stat, basic statistics, normality test, and then we under variable we double click on data, and then the same s thing that we checked in the last exercise. None and Anderson Darling, then we hit OK, then we get our probability plot and the p-value is lower than, than 0 0.005, which means the data is not normal as expected because we created the data with a uniform distribution so this result was expected. Um, thank you for watching.